This is the Fitzy News, the show where you are updated on the latest stories involving Cape Town tiffs. My name is Mark Fitzgibbon, and welcome to my vlog. In our top story this evening, crickets have populated the city tenfold. So much so that awkward silences have become even more awkward. Fuchi! FedEx, the catering company serving the University of Cape Town students' food, has taken this opportunity to update their menu. Soggy chicken bits with rock-hard bread and a side of, yes, cricket. In other news, politicians are gearing up for the next general elections to take place next month on May 7th. Jacob Zuma owes the state a puss lot of money. Helen Ziller is making promises that seem extremely bogus. Julius Malema is scaring the shit out of everyone with his penis resembling hat thing. And Mampele Rampele Puskaknai Tete keeps on saying Aha! Aha! In more local news, a Smith Tiff has been found guilty of arson, probably for being a complete ass. She tried to set her boyfriend's penis alight after finding out that he sent a BBM message to his ex-girlfriend. In sports news, Oscar Pistorius is pretty much being fucked forwards, backwards and sideways by prosecutor Gerry Nell. Gerry Nell. Gerry. Gerry. Something Nell. Whom everyone thinks is a douche, but is probably the one in the right. Your weather for the week ahead? Flooding. A tiff flood. Hide your children. And showers of crickets. The nyers are everywhere. And for your actual weather, well, you all have apps for that. One final piece of news, there are new WeChat stickers in the sticker shop that can be downloaded for free. Look at these. Download WeChat for free. <laughs> Speaking with this accent actually makes my back stink. And those are the stories for this evening, or afternoon, or morning. Don't forget to subscribe for news on the latest Tiffery. I am Mark Fitzgibbon. Thank you and for check. <laughs>